The trend in January was record snowfall, and it seems February doesn't want to be outdone because another winter blast is on its way, and people are preparing. I'm planning on going home. Well, first getting a lot of groceries and going home and spending the day with my husband or several days, whichever. This winter, many of us are learning to deal with the piles of snow and bitter temps. I'm just getting used to it. But it doesn't mean we have to like it. I'm ready to go to Florida. For state and city road crews, long days haven't stopped since the last couple of weather beatings we took. It has been a busy, busy year for us. Workers have stayed on 12 hour shifts. When they aren't clearing snow, they're filling potholes. I mean, what we're dealing with weather wise and even pavement wise is been a big challenge. And every severe weather event knocks those potholes loose again while creating new ones. And the process repeats. We're taking care of um, any potholes that we do have out on the interstate system and also our other state and federal routes and then immediately jump into ice and snow. And while the job of road maintenance may seem tedious and never ending this winter. We've got quite the challenge ahead of us if we do see that significant snowfall that is forecasted. Crews have a steady routine to get everyone through. They're ready to go. It's just a matter of uh, getting the plows on, dumping the salt in, and getting ready to go back on the roadway. Used to it or not, there's one thought everyone can get behind. Spring should be coming shortly, hopefully. And just in case you were counting, spring is just 44 days away. Chris Del Camp, WN, WO News.